The first 30 days of your network marketing career are so important. And I want to share with you three of the things that you're doing that are crushing your business. They're crushing your future. And this might be a great video for you to share with all of your teams as they're getting started. Cause like, I'll talk to you as if you're brand new. I want to share with you the three things you need to avoid. First, is that you wait until you're an expert. You wait till you know everything. You start reading all the stuff about the products or the services or the company, or you wait till you have all this information versus like getting started and like having some conversations and sending out some messages and do your posts and reach out to people. You wait until you're an expert. My friend, success loves speed and speed loves simplicity. Like you just take action, even if it's unperfect action, even if it's just like, you stumble forward, it's just a left foot, right foot, left foot, right foot, left foot, right foot business. You just got to get started. Like, let's go make that first contact. You may stumble through it. It may not be perfect. That's how success works. You know, we've been trained our whole life that failure is bad. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, we don't want to fail. Like, don't fail in class or don't fail in your job. Listen, failure is fertilizer as an entrepreneur and your success will grow in the fertilizer of failure. So in other words, Failure is part of the gig. It's okay for you to fail. Remember, there's more people out there than mistakes you can make. You've got to take action. You've got to get going. you got to like do the post, talk to the people, start your business, like launch. Amateurs join professionals launch. Amateurs join a company, a professional launch is a multi-million dollar business. Go into like, I'm going to launch something mode. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not just going to like join and just like quietly like step into it. Like I'm going to try and create a little bit of speed, a little bit of momentum, a little bit of excitement. Momentum is a secret to business. So you say, I'm going to go for this. Instead of like maybe making a call, I'm going to make two or three, like get into your business. Don't wait till you know everything. You're never going to be an expert. And even if you turned yourself into a guru expert, you won't duplicate that. Like no one else is going to be able to be you. So in other words, leverage the system, lean into the system, let the system be the expert versus you being the expert. Okay. Number two, they try and build their business on empty. Listen, my friend, you can't build your business or your life on empty. What does that mean? You can't drive your car around on empty. You can't build your business on empty, meaning you've got to pour some positivity into your life. Like you got to read some positive books, listen to some positive information. Hopefully, you know, get around some positive people that are pouring some life into you. The uninspired cannot inspire. So to inspire, you must be inspired. Like the uninspired cannot inspire. Like you're not going to go out there and tell people like, Hey, here's where I'm going and here's what I'm going to do. Maybe take a bullet or two. Someone laughs at you said that it's not going to work for you. If you're uninspired, if you're trying, if you're on empty, you haven't poured anything into the well. Imagine you're pulling water out of a well. If there's no water in the well, you can't give what you don't have. Empty plates don't feed starving kids. You got to pour some into you. I tell people that at least 10 minutes a day, at least 10 minutes a day, hopefully preferably early in the morning, first thing in the morning, start pouring some positive and no news, no social media, no like email or text, like pour some positive in so that when you call people, you're like, you know what? You remind yourself, like I can do this, <laughs> you know, cause you got some positive things flowing through your mind. You like start seeing your future a little bit and you start creating your future with your future versus your past. In other words, you create your future with the future vision you have of yourself versus your past. So don't try and build your business on empty. You can't build a business, a life on empty. You can't drive around your town on empty. You got to like pour some water into the well because you can't give what you don't have. So make sure you're, you're developing yourself. You build some habits and some patterns that pour some water into the well. Okay. Third thing is don't recreate all the systems. Don't go launch your own Facebook group and go create your own opportunity video and go freaking go create all your own PDFs. Like my friend, listen, you got to get into action. Make your first million with a proven system. And then after that, you can do what you want to do. You know what I'm saying? Like you say, but there's not enough people that look like me on this current system. I got to go build my own. There's not enough people from my part of town. There's not a, listen, the hardest city or the hardest part of the country or the hardest town to build in is the town you live in. Everyone feels this way. They're like, no one in my town's interested. I'm like, dude, no one in any town's interested. Let's just go to work. Let's go. That's meaning that we all have these self-limiting beliefs that like, my, my people, I don't want to hear you talk about my people. Listen, I've heard people like my demographic, my people, you know, the rich ones, the, this ones, the, that ones, they don't, they don't relate to this. Listen, you don't have to go build all your own stuff. Now on one hand, you'd say, listen, I'm a leader and I'm trying to lead. I get it, but just plug in, just plug in and go. 
Now, one of the reasons is because you, people say, when should I break away from my current team? Here's the answer. You should break away from your current team when you want your current team to break away from you. Do you want every person that joins your business, everyone, day one, they should break away and start building all their own systems and their own teams and their own strategies? No, you're gonna, it, it, that's gonna be a disaster. So make your first million with a current system. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, go crush it with your current system. Once you've got that thing mastered, you got some, you got your sea legs a little bit, you, you kind of got your feet under you a little bit, a little bit of confidence, a little bit of credibility, then we can build some improvements into the system. Then we can say, okay, let's make this a little bit better. So in your first 30 days, you gotta get to work. Success loves speed. Speed loves simplicity. Like just go to work, just do the simple actions. Make the simple strokes. Like you don't have to be a guru month one. All of us that started, you know, my team, I'm one of the biggest networkers on the planet now. You know, it's the craziest thing ever, but you have 4 million customers and 1.7 billion in sales with our team. Listen, I was, I sucked, you know, <laughs> when I started, I was terrible. Like anything that's worth doing is worth doing poorly until you learn how to do it well and you just start. Step one, step two, left foot, right foot. Even if you're stumbling forward, start taking action. Do the thing you fear the most and the death of fear is certain. Like start taking action and get into action. Let's go. You, you got this thing and you're going to learn and you're going to improve. Remember, there's no winning and losing as an entrepreneur. There's winning and learning. You either win or you learn. If you learn something, then you win. So you're winning or learning. If you're learning, you're winning. It's that simple. So just get into action, start making things happen. Proud of you guys. If you guys got some value, share this with your new people, share this with your teams. A click also in the link in the description. We have a ton of other free content. My heart and my passion is to serve you. I know what it's like to be stuck. I know what it's like to like have no confidence in this thing. I know what it's like to not know how to move to that next level and I want to help you break through. I want to help you to become not the person you are, but the person you were born to become. So click the link, share the video, and I look forward to talking to you guys again real soon. Thank you.